Hi. Hi. And what's your name? My name is Manuel Schiffler. Okay. And I see that you are the KFW Development Bank. That's right. Okay. What do you do, essentially? Well, I'm working in KFW's policy unit, so mm -hmm. I uh, work on adaptation to climate change and other water issues. And in addition to that, I'm also a project manager for projects in Morocco, big sanitation project, and in Jordan. And the Wikipedia, is that something like a, a side project of yours? It's sort of a side project. I started it when I used to work at the World Bank about mm -hmm. three years ago. Mm -hmm. And uh, we started to do country topic overviews on water supply and sanitation. Mm -hmm. um, so they're about 10 pages. They cover all the main topics, uh, mm -hmm. the history of the sectors, the main institutions, what are the challenges, what are the achievements, what are different donors doing, financial aspects, all in a very uh, concise way and always using footnotes, references and hyperlinks to primary sources. So it's actually quite a, a good, well done research pro, uh, document, but on Wikipedia. Yes, but they're never complete. I mean, sometimes we like some information, we hope it's going to be improved mm -hmm. and uh, it has a very high visibility, mm -hmm. uh, but it would be great if more people, especially those who are in the countries, mm -hmm. could contribute. Okay. So, for example, let's, let's, uh, could you give me an example where you've seen that it's moved beyond the one article that you have done for a particular country? Mm -hmm. uh, let's take the Brazil example. Um, we had uh, an article that gave a broad overview and someone said, look, you haven't done a lot on privatization. So, mm -hmm. there's a lot of privatization going on. About 10% of the population of Brazil is served by private concessions. And the person started to uh, significantly expand that section and there was some interaction, comment on it, and it, it really looks nice. There's a huge table now with every single concession contract mm -hmm. in, uh, in, Morocco, uh, mm -hmm. in Brazil. Mm -hmm. So, uh, for example, now do you see more people writing on, on them independently or do you think we still need to give a bit of push for the articles to be expanded? Um, definitely there's a need for a push. I mean, uh, some people know about what I'm doing. I'm not the only one who's writing, but the other people who have actually written comprehensive articles, um, I, I know them, and it usually takes about a week, a week to ten, maybe five to ten working days, depending on the experience and the amount of information that's available to do one good article. So it's not something that you can do easily on the side, mm -hmm. but still compared to what other people spend, I mean, big donor agencies, UN agencies on, on producing reports, it's still peanuts. Right. And But the huge uh, articles that tend to get produced, are, I mean, in my opinion, they're hardly read. The good thing of in Wikipedia is that everybody reads it and Absolutely. it's very easy to find it information. Yeah, if you Google it, it's usually one of the first five hits, especially if you Google the name of the country and sanitation right. in combination. Right. Right. If you do water and the name of the country, it might be among the first ten hits. Okay, so what are the next plans for it? No? Well, next plan is to gradually expand it to other countries. Since I work now for the German Development Corporation, we try to focus on countries uh, where German Development Corporation is very active, um, but it's sort of a slow process because I have a full-time job doing other things, as I mentioned, so it's a little bit something on the side. Um, we get, uh, previously at the World Bank, I had some funding. Uh, we hope to get some more funding uh, and volunteer contributions, but I realize for, the, for a volunteer to spend 10 working days creating a new article will be hard, but maybe volunteers can improve the existing articles or comment on them. Not everyone knows that there is a comment section for every article on Wikipedia and you can contribute to it and uh, certainly I, I have all those articles on my watch list. The watch list allows every registered user to see any changes both on the discussion page on, and on the article itself, which is a way of ensuring that the quality of the article doesn't deteriorate but also that comments don't go unnoticed. Okay, thanks a lot. You're welcome.